Determine, without graphing, whether the quadratic function f of x equals negative 2x squared plus 12x minus 16 has a minimum value or a maximum value. Then find the minimum or maximum value and where it occurs. So we see that this is a quadratic function and therefore we look at this term, the negative 2x squared, and because the coefficient of the x squared term is negative, that tells us that this would be a parabola opening down, which means that it has a maximum value. That maximum of value occurs at the vertex of this parabola. And so to find the x coordinate of the vertex, we use the formula that x is equal to the opposite of b divided by 2a. Substituting in those values, the opposite of b, the coefficient of the linear term, 12. Divided by 2 times a, a is negative 2, so 2 times negative 2. Evaluating that, we find that x is equal to 3. So that's the x coordinate. To find the actual maximum value, that would be find the y coordinate, which in terms of f of x would be f of 3. So we substitute 3 in place of x here and here. So we have negative 2 times 3 squared plus 12 times 3 minus 16. When we evaluate that whole expression, we find that f of 3 is equal to 2. And that means that the maximum value of 2 occurs at x equals 3. Find the domain and range of the function f of x is equal to negative 2x squared plus 12x minus 16. This is a quadratic function. And therefore, we know that the domain is the set of all real numbers, or in interval notation, negative infinity through infinity. The range, however, we just determined that the maximum value of f of x occurred at x equals 3, and that gives a maximum value of 2. So therefore, the range is negative infinity up to and including 2.